To me, the Thompson is the ultimate Pacific Northwest experience. We're surrounded by the mountains, the forest, and the sea. My focus in the kitchen here is not only to showcase the local product that the Pacific Northwest gives us, but also to highlight some of the amazing ingredients that each season has to offer. So for example, in the Puget Sound, we're just spoiled with Dungeness crab. It's by far my favorite thing to indulge in, and it's fun to use as an ingredient because it's so versatile. The meat is naturally sweet, and when cooked properly, it's super juicy. I'm using a variety of different citrus fruits like mandarins, ruby grapefruit, blood oranges, and caracaras. The Dungeness crab is the best in the winter months, and that's also when citrus fruits are their sweetest. And then I made an aioli with toasted bonito and pureed it with a little bit of lemon. So this gives the dish a little burst of umami in terms of flavor and a little creaminess in terms of texture. This is plated on a Libby Syracuse China silk coupe. I like this plate because of its simplicity. The dishes I actually enjoy making the most, I think, are the simplest ones, the cleanest ones. I like playing with the natural textures and colors of produce, and I love when the dish looks a bit organic. I love to make pasta. Potato gnocchi is one of my absolute favorites. It's actually one of the first pastas I was ever taught how to make as a young cook, and it kind of stuck with me through the years. My favorite way to make potato gnocchi is to bake the potatoes instead of boiling them. Baking them instead of boiling them allows the flesh to remain super dry and fluffy. So when the dough comes together, it's still very light and not dense. The gnocchi are super light and curved, so they hold the sauce really well. This dish highlights two of my favorite local ingredients that grow here in the Pacific Northwest hedgehog mushrooms and truffles. We source our mushrooms through a small family startup of local foragers called Farm and Wild. The mushrooms I'm using in this dish are hedgehog mushrooms, which are at their best in the winter season here in the Pacific Northwest. I sear off the hedgehog mushrooms with a little leek and garlic until aromatic, and then reduce with a little cream, butter, and parmesan. The sauce clings to the starches in the gnocchi and lightly coats it. I plated the gnocchi on the Driftstone Coupe Plate by Libby. It presents the dish very elegantly and doesn't distract from the overall simplicity of the dish. The truffle is then shaved generously on top. I love this dish because the smell of the truffle just permeates the entire room.